All right, so this is the Flissa. It is D2. This is a bushcraft style knife. So far, no problems. Fire starting, it is full tang. You can get it in Marcata handles. These handles here, I got in the G10. And this knife right here is so ridiculously sharp. I mean, it is just so sharp. I tried to feather stick with it and it was just like digging right in. I'll have to show you a little bit of it, but uh, so far for the price, I don't know. I'm thinking this is a pretty decent budget bushcraft knife in my opinion. We're missing the bipod today, but this stuff with anything small, it's no problem to just hack right through it. It's so stinking sharp. I mean, I was feather sticking stuff up and you can do fairly well, I guess you'd say, but look how sharp it is. I mean, it's just sharp enough to just cut stuff right apart. Uh, as far as chopping stuff, uh, no problems there. Let's see if you can see where am I at here. You may be able to see it right there. And you can pretty much chop a lot of that smaller stuff. No problems. It's uh, just an overall, feels pretty good in your hand. You can, you can get some meat on it. I don't have the widest hands, but it's easy to hold. It's easy to cut anything. It's really easy to notch stuff. If you have to notch anything, you just peel it. No problem like that. Let's see if I can get this sideways a little bit. And then if you just literally push down to cut it, it would just cut. I don't know, you could probably hear that, depending. But notching anything like that, this is a joke. Just regular whittling stuff, you just gotta watch out that you don't whittle right down. It's so sharp so sharp it just wants to catch i'm sure it will get a little bit better um i batoned a little bit of stuff with it i know it's pretty short maybe i'll try to get a little bit of video of that real quick but it worked just fine nothing wrong with the tip everything's really great for the price yeah, i'll try to baton a smaller piece just so you can see real quick i can't find nothing that's uh very big right now but any kind of abuse this thing so far that we've done as just had no problems whatsoever with any of it. It's uh, just a decent little budget, really sharp, really sharp budget knife. Um, no problems taking bark off, no problems anything. It's not too heavy, it's not too light. Um, but you can, you can get whatever done with it you need. Does it cut rope? Yeah. <laughs> this thing's sharp. This thing is just really sharp. I do like it. So I'll probably end up giving this to Backwoods Rustic. Uh, you can check his channel out if you'd like. But he really liked this thing. And uh, yeah, I don't know much more to say about this thing. It's just been a decent little budget piece. There's been really just no problems with it and it has stayed sharp through quite a bit so let me know what you think down in the comments um yeah and we'll see you again soon okay so aside from the cheap leather sheath i would have liked it if it had some sort of jimping or something there you know something to grip to some grooves that were a little bit thicker for when you are doing stuff but literally that's probably it for as far as maybe complaints if you want to call it that more like preference seems to be doing great